anyone can be a gamer, even if it's like... Visual novels. Okay, now I'm about to say something controversial. Visual novels are not games. Fact. They're just books that trick you into reading. So how do I better explain this? Back when I was a kid, while I learned how to read normally, the rich bougie parents would go buy their kids like this thing called a leapfrog, which is basically like this big fancy toy that tricked kids into learning how to read. There's like interactive stuff that you can do, like it'll tell you to pet the froggy, and then the frog does something, but in reality, it's just there to distract you from the fact that you're reading. So yeah, visual novels are kind of like that, but for weebs. You see, back when anime was invented, everyone began to start watching anime. The entire world became weebs, and everyone stopped reading. The stock on books plummeted. So, how did they get everybody reading again? The only difference now is you don't see anyone reading these in public. Okay, so if you're like a writer that's like struggling to sell a book or whatever, what if... You took whatever you wrote, threw some anime characters on it, and then turned it into a visual novel. Boom! Here now you're Ricky and all that money, baby! Money talks. Okay, wait, that actually sounds like a good idea. Like, imagine we took all the books that they made you read in school, and then we just turned them into visual novels. I think more people would actually read the books rather than read the chapter summary online. Hello, CEO of education. Hear me out. What if we took all the books we made people read and then threw some anime characters on them and then turned them into visual novels? Kelvin, it's three in the morning. So you can argue if visual novels are games or not, but at the end of the day, you're a weeb that got tricked into reading by some anime characters. But, you know, Ace Attorney is a pretty good game. 